Hey, what's going on, everyone? It's Kyle Henderson of BamaInsider.com. Today, I'm talking about NFL mock draft predictions for Alabama players, and we kick it off with six foot four, 289 pound redshirt sophomore who's declaring for the NFL draft early and for good reason. Quinn Williams. He had 71 total tackles, eight sacks, and had an overall pro football focus grade of 96.0. His pass rush grade. 92.5 92.5 and he had 29 hurries on quarterbacks draft wire and walterfootball.com have williams projected as the number one overall pick going to the arizona cardinals nfl.com and cbs have williams going number four to the raiders another player to declare early from alabama is jonah williams six foot five 301 pounds williams had an overall pro football focus grade of 89.2 his pass blocking grade right at 88.6 on the season. Williams did not allow a single sack, and we've seen mock drafts have him as high as number six and number seven overall. CBS.com has him going at number six to the New York Giants. We keep it going. Joshua Jacobs, and what a season he had, especially at the end of the year. Five foot 10, 216 pounds, definitely one of the most versatile running backs entering the NFL draft. And yes, He's another player that declared early, leaving after his junior season. Jacobs rushed for 640 yards, 120 carries, and 11 touchdowns. Jacobs also proved to be a good receiver out of the backfield, recording 20 receptions for 247 yards with three more scores. He also had 408 yards returning kickoffs. His average, get this, right at 31.4. NFL.com, in their latest mock draft, has Jacobs going number five overall to the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Deontay Thompson, yet another player declaring early for the NFL draft, is a six foot two, 196 pound safety. Known as the team's pound for pound hardest hitter, Thompson's overall pro football focus grade was 88.4, and he was second on the team in total tackles with 78. 31 of those were solo tackles, and he recorded two interceptions on the season. CBS.com and DraftWire.com both project Thompson as a first round pick going to either Philadelphia or to Seattle. Mac Wilson, yes, another Alabama junior projected in the first round at 6'2", 239 pounds. Wilson recorded 65 total tackles this season with two interceptions. Wilson, the team's defensive signal caller, posted a season-ending pro football focus grade of just 71.8 and graded out very low against Oklahoma and Clemson to end the season. Despite those low marks, NFL.com has Wilson going number 28 to the Chargers. Yep, another player leaving after his junior season from Alabama is Irv Smith. Six foot four, 241 pounds, had a very solid season, recording 44 receptions, 710 yards with seven touchdowns. Smith's grayed out on Pro Football Focus right at 82.3, and both CBS. Dot com and WalterFootball.com mock drafts have him going in round one to either the Raiders or to New England. I think Irv Smith's going to be a big hit in the NFL this coming season. Oddly enough, the first senior projected to go off the board could come in round two for Alabama. That's Damian Harris, the running back who projects from Walter Football and DraftWire.com to go to the Raiders. But here's this. Walter Football has him going at number 35 overall, and DraftWire has him going at number 66. This season, Harris ran for 876 yards with nine touchdowns and also caught for 200 yards out of the backfield. The previous two seasons, Harris hit the 1,000-yard mark. Other Alabama players to watch in the NFL draft in the later rounds, 6'5", 286-pound Isaiah Bugs who is slated to go number 78 to the Miami Dolphins. This season, Bugs recorded a team-high 9.5 sacks and was really incredible getting to the quarterback as well as stuffing up the run this season. Ross Pierce Baker is projected at number 79 to the Atlanta Falcons by DraftWire.com. Pierce Baker started in every game at center this season, taking over for Bradley Bozeman. Christian Miller at 6'4", 244 pounds, had a great season, 34 tackles and eight and a half sacks, and is projected to go number 83 to Pittsburgh. Thanks for joining us today on our YouTube channel. This is Kyle Henderson of BamaInsider.com. Continue to stay with us at BamaInsider.com as we continue to deliver high-quality Alabama football content right to your doorstep on our YouTube channel. Also, head on over to BamaInsider.com for exclusive 
in-depth team analysis pieces, recruiting coverage, and much more at BamaInsider.com.